Okay, so today I'm going to be showing how to adjust the 240SX um, hatch latch um, because the hatch, when you pull the pull the handle, the thing stays locked unless you hold it open, and then you got to kind of double team it. So I'm going to show you how to fix that here. All right, so first thing you do, obviously, go into the hatch, and there's this panel here that you're going to have to remove. There's about four screws and two clips there. So the four screws are right here, one, two, three, four, and the clips are here, one, two, and you pull it off. And then here's the latch mechanism here. And there's two 10 millimeters here we're gonna to wanna to loosen and adjust. It's super easy, I'll show you how we do that. All right, so I'm just taking my 10 millimeters here, I'll loosen these little guys up. And you'll see, once you just loosen them, you don't have to remove them all the way, just loosen them. You can see this thing flops around. So since it wasn't releasing, um, I'm assuming it was too high up, so I'm going to go ahead and slide it down to the lowermost part, see if that works. If it doesn't, I'll move from there. But, so there's that, I'm just tightening them down. I'm going to leave the plastic off for now for testing it, um, and then I'm going to close the hatch and try to pop it. Alright, I'm going to have somebody pop the hatch with the latch right now and see what happens. That's a good sign, you couldn't hear that noise before at all. And the hatch opens up. Try it again. Yep, that's a good sign. You can actually hear that noise. So there we go. That is it. Basically, there wasn't a whole lot to that. Didn't have to do much adjusting. I just slid it to the lowermost part. So that way, when it pops up, pops there, the hatch kind of clicks up like that. So yeah, that was super quick. Not a whole lot to it. I'm sure this works on other cars. Its latches are pretty similar on. Most, most hatchback vehicles.